Hi, so in this chapter of Python syntax, let me write the heading first, Python and then syntax. So S Y N T A X. Okay. So first we will learn about a important topic which is called Python indentation. Okay. So here, what is the indentation means? Look, indentation basically refers to the spaces at the beginning of the code line. Okay. So that the code could get in a very readability format. Okay. And it is really very important. What I am telling you, let me tell you by an example. Just suppose here I am writing a code like if 5 is greater than 2 and if I'll put a semicolon over here and I'll and press enter, then you can see the cursor is already intended. Okay. This is the line. The gap is there. This gap is called indentation and it is really very important. If you use any IDE like um, PyCharm, uh, Jupyter Notebook or uh, Visual Studio Code, any IDE for using Python, the indentation will create automatically. You don't need to create the indentation by your own. Okay. So this is the very good thing that this is an I generally recommend uh, IDE for using uh, the code in uh, Python. Okay. So here, just suppose I'll write print. Okay. And then here I am writing five is greater. Five is greater. Okay. So let me run this. Here you can see the code runs successfully. Okay. So but if you will remove the indentation in any case, then it will show me the error. Expected and indented block. Okay. So you don't need to uh, remove this thing. This thing will create automatically. And that's the reason indentation is really much needed. Okay. You will see the most of the indentation in the next uh, chapters, next upcoming chapters. Okay. You will learn uh, um, very deep, definitely. Okay. So this is uh, all these things are basically indentation. Okay. Secondly, I want to tell you about the Python variables. Variables. Okay. Uh, look, Python variables are created when you assign a value to it. Like just suppose I had taken x is equal to 5. So 5 is the value which is now assigned to a variable x. And the same goes to y also. Just suppose I have here I have written uh, Sharad Kare, my name. Okay. And I'll print this thing. Print x. Okay. And then I'll print y. Same. So what will happen if you run this? Look, 5 is written. Sharad Kare is written. 5 is written because we have printed x and y is written because we have printed Sharad Kare. Uh, uh, Sharad Kare is printed because we have written y. Okay. Means these both value now contain 5 and Sharad Kare. You need to know one thing. This Python has no command for declaring a variable. And even you will learn more about the variable in the Python variable chapter which is, uh, I think, just three or four uh, videos upcoming. Okay. So that's all for this uh, variable. Next, we will discuss about uh, comments. These actually videos I am talking about only the syntaxes so that you could know the basic of syntaxes. Okay. Now, the comments. How you will write comment? This you know this this hashtag is a comment okay this python has actually a commenting capability for the purpose of inline code documentation and generally it start with this hash okay and even you can use three inverted comma single one two three okay here also you can write something 
it will automatically get concluded in the comment even you can write double inverted comma also three this thing also you can use this thing is basically the multi line okay you can use it anywhere the same goes to single inverted comma also but if you will use hashtag in a multi line it will not come for multi line you'll have to put the code again and again like this okay if you want to use a multi line then you you can use single inverted comma three times or double inverted comma three times or if you comment a single line then you can use the hashtag in a single line or separately you can give the hashtag line by line okay so these are the basic syntaxes of uh, the python okay hope you understood so that's all for this video let's move to the next video